Hello, Charlene here with the new journal. Been away for a while. Um, this one is called The Old Abbey, and she is 15 by 22 and 10 squishy. She's very full. 52 pages, 104 both sides. Um, Just open her up. This is, um, what have we got? Vintage Abbey postcards. Um, and other inserts and other vintage ephemera. Handmade as well. Scrapbook paper with vintage wallpaper for the cover. And two signatures. So that's her there. Is the back. Some of that. It's just a copy, of course, of um, the old. Is it called illuminated text? I can't remember. Right, here we go. Closure is this nice, what I thought to be wooden rosary, but it's not wooden. Still cute, and it does the job. So that's pretty. Um, and this was inspired by. You have to go and watch it. Angels and Artifacts by Jane Chip on the Graphics Fairy YouTube channel. Right, here we go. Oh, postcard on the front. Um, called The Old Abbey, which was cool. I just found that by chance. Pretty bring pretty things on the cover. The inside. The quote by Mother Teresa here. Some envelopes down here. They have little cards in them. Little Abbey uh, cigarette card. Pretty tag with uh, the dictionary. Um, listing of the Abbey, of an Abbey. Newburgh, the Abbey in Newburgh, vintage postcard. Okay. Oh, I have some of the Da Vinci angels in, in this one. This has a another pretty Abbey postcard inside and some embossed recycled paper and this old envelope lots of little inserts in this pretty pocket on, t on this um, braille bible page Is that that little card back there? Little card. More of that illuminated text. A little one of those. And I think this was called the Holy Family, the little angels in the corner. Has some fun little things in there for you. Another spool, tiny spool, with some embroidery thread and other little inserts. There's a tag in here and this vintage envelope. Journal spot there. Little card behind me. 
these open. There are little cards in these as well. Tag and more illuminated text copy. I painted um, out the background like Jane Chip did in her journal. I really wanted to try it. It looks so pretty. Little journal card. Little tag at the back. There's a little scroll in here. Just undo the bow or you can just slip it out. It's not in there too tightly. This uh, is based on, what was it called, a scapular, the religious fabric necklace thingies that they wear. It's my little take on it, and the other side is a heart. And both pieces are fabric, and there's some crunchy paper and sewn into the centre. Make a nice bookmark. Is the center of both signatures. Inside is this lovely vintage or yeah vintage meditation series booklet. It's quite a few pages. That's from the 30s. It's really pretty. Love the blue. It goes in the dolly, little dolly pouch. these little buttons have the smallest little thread holes um, and they're vintage probably for some specific use it's one of those vintage postcard Abbey in Yorkshire lovely page of herbs another spool of um, fabric I think about 90 centimeters of this coffee dyed fabric It's pretty. This is a tag inside, so you can just slip that out. That's a threefold. Another Da Vinci Angel. This is a journal card. A glassine bag pocket. Another Abbey vintage postcard. Is an envelope of I forgot a um, little cross and a pretty bauble. It has a some pages and the equator journal on use inside your journal. in here. Another angel. An envelope. With a an old receipt interval and a book page, vintage book page on birdies Angel, an envelope with a vintage postcard Palace 
of something. And back of this is just a journaling space spot. My little paper flowers. Some pretty tags here. Limbalipi with it's in there. Some angel paper. And this was from a folder I found from a friend to a friend regarding this abbey. Uh, the ruins of that's now been restored apparently. 1947. And that is the old Abbey. Which is really chunky. Okay, well thank you very much for looking, for watching, and we'll see you soon with my next project. Thank you, bye.